Clinic, you were mentioning earlier about how I disrespected the GWA belt and all this. Well, see, that's not really the case. I think you kind of misunderstood what I was really trying to say to you. You see, I was given this job by Lawrence to withhold your company, actually, the MSW. So, in doing so, yes, I am a little bit wrapped up in things right now, I'll admit, but my fault was is that I'd rather hold the company that I wrestle for as belt than the company that oversees everything. Don't get me wrong, I understand where you're coming from, but I'm the MSW general manager. I would like to hold this belt. Now, that day of the show, yeah, I admit, I might have been... I could have probably pulled something off, but I wasn't really interested in that, that day. But today, my friend, it's a different day. You see, my only match is today against you for the GWA belt. I'm 100%. I'm hoping you're 100%. So, once we get out there and pull this whole thing off, tear it down, once everything all is said and done, once you're done flapping your gums and all your clinic bowl crap, I'm not only going to have just one belt, but I'm also going to be the GWA champion on this side as well. Now that's uh. a clinic. Jet, being a champion isn't just something you do sometimes. Being a champion means that you wake up in the morning as the champion, you go to bed at night as the champion. Every minute of every day, every waking hour, every sleeping hour, you are the champion. And that should be the case with you and the MSW World Heavyweight Championship, me and the GWA World Backyard Wrestling Championship. I think about this title constantly. I think about my upcoming defenses, I think about how to win, I think about how to avoid losing. And you know, that's the fact is that to be a champion, you have to give it 100% dedication. You cannot have a day off. You cannot be willing to give yourself a day off. And I want you to hear this too, Aaron, because you need to live by this as well. Because you have that match with Lawrence coming up. The thing, Jet, is that you have to come, you have to approach this match not worrying about the difference between MSW and the GWA. I appreciate what you're trying to do for MSW, and I did help build MSW. In fact, I was one of the co-founders along with FIRE. But, first and foremost, we are wrestlers. And that means we will do whatever it takes to get to the top. Whether it's me surviving a six-man match to become the GWA World Backyard Wrestling Champion. Whether it's Jet in his bitter feud with Ozzy Lyons and then going against me. Whether it's uh, Aaron Riot looking to take the next step against Lawrence Alfred. And I'm going to walk into this match. I've wrestled you so many times before, Jet, and I've learned from those experiences. And I just hope you will give me the best match you possibly can. I want to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with you. Hell, we may hit that 60-minute mark. And if we do, I want to damn sure make the judge's job hard because I want it to be this close. Now, Aaron... Or I was going to have you come out with me to watch my match, but I know you, you have a little something right here thanks to a certain somebody. Uh, so I'll tell you what we'll do. I want you to go home. I want you to get some ice on this, and I want you to research. I want you to do your research on Lawrence. I want you to do your research on MSW, the GWA, the history of wrestling. And I will get catch up with you soon. We're going to get some training done. And at Boiling Point, I'll come out with you. You'll come out with me. We will be one unit, and you will learn from me exactly what it takes to take on Lawrence. Got it. So I want you to go home. I want you to get ready. And I want you to be ready for Boiling Point. Right. And as for you, Jack... I want you to get ready. I want you at 100% because if you falter for even a moment, I will be there to pick up the pieces. I will be there to take you out and retain my GWA World Backyard Wrestling Championship. I hope the world is ready. I hope the GWA is ready for a classic. And I say let's go, let's screw the rules and let's go out and do this thing. Now that's a clinic. All it is for the GWA Backyard Wrestling Championship. Introducing first the special guest referee. Ladies and gentlemen, former UWA champion, Sam Remino. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah! yeah! Woo! The criminal!
He's dangerous, people. He's even more dangerous as a rep. All right, the rules of this match is simple. There is no disqualification except with the case of outside No disqualifications except Here for outside are Here are the contestants. contestants. Ladies and gentlemen, the GWA World Heavyweight Backyard Wrestling Championship, the clinic, the GWA champion versus one of the greatest of all time, J.E.W.T. And here comes J.E.W.T. Yeah! Current yeah. 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 MSW World Heavyweight Champion and the MSW General Manager, J.E.W.T. I wonder what his mental status is in this matchup against the clinic. Yeah, I mean, I haven't been here in a while, and you know that. But, uh, I don't know. We're just gonna have to wait and see. Take away? All right. All right. I think he's good. All right, he's good. I think. I felt a little hard to bother between the legs. Ladies and gentlemen. These two men have faced each other so many times. Whoa. It is yeah. unnatural. Wow. There it is, folks, yeah. the GWA World Heavyweight Championship. Yeah! Introducing to my left, he is the challenger. He is the current Mid-South Wrestling Heavyweight Champion of the World. He is the J.E. Double T. Ladies and gentlemen, Shit. To my right, he is the reigning and defending GWA Backyard Wrestling Champion of the World, the Clinic. Watch out, man. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Derek Clement here commentating one of the greatest matchups of all time. It is the champion, the Clinic, versus the competitor, J. E double T. And there it is. The ref is holding it. GWA World Backyard Wrestling title on the line. Ooh. It's about to get in crazy. 60 Ooh. minute time limit. No disqualification unless of outside interference. Gentlemen, you're ready. Ready? ready. Ring the bell. And here we go. Here we go. Jet's moving the shooter boot. He's moving around the ring here. Here we go. What a uh, original. St oh, uh, lockout. He's got him in. He's got. He's trying to get STF already. He's got him in the STF. What's gonna happen here? He brings the ropes. Jet, do you give up? He's trying to get the ropes. He got the ropes. He's got the ropes. Rope break. Let go. Two. Count of two at rope break. Got him in the SCF jet. Needs to be careful right here because the clinic has one of the greatest mindsets in GWA history. He will do anything and everything to win. Side cradle pin. One, two. Two count. Very smart by J. Double C using his out gel and his speed against the clinic. If the clinic's going to win this match, he needs to use his brains. All right, get him out the box. He's throwing them haymaker punches in the corner. Three. Tosses him down on the ring on the campus. Oh, nice kick to the back. Oh, a good shoe hit. Cover. Ladies and gentlemen, that was only a two count. Elbow to the back. Elbow again. Damage in that back section. You give up? He's got him in a side headlock. You give up? No. He's got him in a side headlock. It might not make up tap, but it will make him decrease his damage. He's got, he's got the foot on the rope. Yeah, one. Count at one, count at one. Clinic's using his brain in this match. That's what's going to get him the win here today. 
Here we go. Oh, nice kick to the midsection. Kick to the legs. Kick to the ankle. He's got him in his, what is this? He's got him in, he's got his ankle locked up pretty good. You give up. What's gonna happen right here? And J.E. Double T's fighting back. Throwing them left hooks. Throwing them. One after another. Can you believe, folks? This is screw the rules and anything's going here. Anything is going all day. Back body drop onto the outside of the ring. Beautiful back body drop by the clinic. With the cover. One, two, two count. Two count. Ladies and gentlemen, if you just tuning in right now, you just missed one of the best body back body drops in GWI history. Hey, the shoe go? Oh, yeah, the Hit him shoe. with the shoe. Oh, with the shoe. Trying to get down the rope. Hey, hey, watch hey, it, ref. Watch hey, it, ref. One, Le two, illegal maneuver. Two, three. Technically, there is no disqualification unless of outside interference. Oh, so I was doing it wrong? It's okay, ref. We all learn. We all, all right. learn. You know what? I'm just going to sit down. Here we go! Jet with the with the suplex from hell. Cover. One, two. Two count. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're just tuning in to GWA, screw the rules. This is one of the most extraordinary matches that I've ever seen in my life. The clinic and J E Double T. What is this? Trying to get a, a modified sharpshooter. You give up. You give up. You give up. He's got them legs tied up. He's got them tied up. What is Jack gonna do here? Is he gonna tap out? Are these the men gonna go 60 Come minutes? On. Okay, he wants the rope. One, two. Wait, hold on. So oh, no holes barred. Why no. am I doing this? Why are you doing it? It's you okay. You're trying I to do, do your job. I, I do such a good job. Like it's okay. I, I just I can't stop. Myself. It's okay. Just remember, no. Unless, oh my God! Oh my God! Ugh. I don't know if that connected, Dude, but that up. surely as hell looked beautiful. No, he said no. If J E Double T is going to win today, he needs to outthink the clinic. Get out of it. What is J What is What is J Double T gonna do here? Come on. He's done. He's done. That's one. He's done. That's two. What's gonna happen here? Oh, oh no, he's really fighting back! He's fighting back! That was close! That was close! Gosh! Uh, oh, do you give up? Do you give up? Uh, no. I'm telling you. What is JT's give got a, a weird arm bar on his back? Strange maneuver here, but it's putting some su some suppress on. Oh, a reversal. Uh oh. Oh, jawbreaker! Modified jawbreaker! Cover! One, two, two count. Two count. No DQ. Less of outside interference. I'm sorry, man. No, the modified stunner. Can he get the pin right here? What's it gonna be? Cover. One, two, two count. Two, two count by the clinic. The J E Double T still fighting back. Got him in a side head headlock. Do you give up, Tim? Do you give up? Do you give up? Got him in a side headlock. Oh, and audiences all around, I just found out that... We just broke 10 minutes! You give up. You give up. Do you give up? Oh, and I found out, everyone, that if someone grabs the rope or the foot's on the rope, it does count. Oh, yes. Oh, so corporate out. corporate just told you. Corporate just told Ladies you. Ladies and gentlemen, if they do grab ropes, there are rope breaks. 
Oh, motherfucker, KO! Okay, oh. Holy fuck! Come on! Foot's on the road! Three! That's it! Ring the bell! What? Hey, ding, ding! What else you got, Bill? Hold up, hold up before you hand that belt over. Hold the fuck up. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Uh oh. Is this thing on? I hope not. I don't even need it. <laughs> hold up. That foot is on the rope, ref. That's just your politic and bullshit. Exactly what I'm talking about. Uh, what are you You're, talking about? Are Ladies you and gentlemen, me? I am confused. It's just everyone else here. Uh, I'm the only one out here apparently calling your bluffs. Everyone else is too afraid to tell you something. You're not going to politic your way to the belt. What are you talking about? You did not win I that match. I just whooped his ass. The foot was on the rope. Where were your eyes when you saw that? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm confused. I, I don't know what's going on here. It's me. Ladies and gentlemen, corporate's here. Lawrence Alfred. See, nothing to do with Rob. Lawrence Alfred. Lawrence Alfred. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. We're getting too close to Star Cape for all these shenanigans. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, I understand sometimes people cut in line, and that's not fair. I understand sometimes people steal your parking spots, and that's not fair. But I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Jet. We got to do it right. We're, we're the authority around here. And it's for the GWA Championship, and I'm not having any more controversy with that belt because I'm not vacated again, and I'm not going through all this hell. We're too close to Starcade. Remember, you don't have diplomatic immunity just He's because you're the me. general manager. I got this. His foot was on the rope. You're a special guest referee. I know it's not your normal job. Yeah. You're a criminal and you like robbing things, but I'm the law. Hmm. So I have to set it straight. Okay. Justice is about to be served. The match will continue uh, now. Here we go. Good luck. Oh! Ref! Ref! Oh my god, wait. One, two, three. Why, hey, what the? If you did stay tuned, this is what just happened. RKO equals pin, but corporate just said that the match was here to continue. Clinic hit him with a clinical depression. One, two, three. Ladies and gentlemen, the clinic is still your GWA World Heavyweight Champion. So that's what I fucking call a clean victory. As you can tell, Isaac Lyons is trying to get in the mind of Jade Double T here. Let's give it a round for your champion here. You and I have never had a match where you didn't pull some dirty shit or try something stupid. The first time you never tried any of that. Congratulations. Respect. For the first time in history, the clinic and JE Double T agree and they shook hands as friends. Winner! Your Winner. champion, the clinic. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. 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 Your champion, the GWA World Heavyweight Champion, the Clinic, has retained his title here at Screw the Rules. He lives again. But what is in store for the Clinic at Bowling Point? That is the question. That is the question. Ladies and gentlemen, your champion, the clinic. I'm still the GWA World Backyard Wrestling Champion. Jet, you put in a good fight. Ozzy Lyons, you're next. And Starcade, the advocate. Now that's a clinic. Clinic is now leaving the ring as the champion. He has said what he has to say. And he looks forward to retaining his title at Bowling Point next month. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That was one hell of a clinic. Thank you for joining us. At GWA, screw the rules!